Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Walkthrough with Janice. Today, we're here to check out something really interesting. We're here to take a look at a boutique heritage hotel. Stay tuned to find out more. So in case you're wondering where we are, we are right outside Rocho MRT. You can see how central this place is. We are very close to Raffles Hospital. We are also very close to Suntec City. Now, we are at the junction of Perak Road and Sungai Road. And for those history buffs, Sungai Road was originally part of the Bukit Timah Road, which used to join Johor Bahru with Johor Road. It was built more than 100 years ago during the colonial days. So without further ado, let's take a look at the hotel. Now you have your cruise to nowhere, you have your flights to nowhere. How about staying in Singapore as a tourist for an entire month? So this is one of the nice places in Singapore where you really feel the heritage ambience, but you have all the amenities. I really like the street ambience here. You've got shop houses on both sides. It's all low rise, nice and quiet. But at the same time, look, you've got laundromats, you've got your foodie places, you even have lodges. Yeah, a lot this of location places. is very, very close to all your tourist spots as well. You have plenty of temples, you have heritage areas to explore, as well as plenty of eateries as well. In fact, right behind us, a uh, place to Yeah, eat, there's I a think. place just beside. Oh, we are already reaching the hotel. Yeah, wow, that's a, a really oh. short walk. There's a laundromat here, there's another one opposite there. So yeah, it's a really convenient area. Conveniences. As well as a mini mart right in front. Yes. Wow, so wow. this is the entrance to Perak Hotel. Just take a look at it, it looks a little bit like the Mediterranean style, very Greece like. Yeah, with the, the color white scheme. and blue. Yeah. Very nice. Let's take a look inside. Wow, this is like a step back in time. Really love this place. So just to give you a sense of where this place is, Perak Hotel is located at 12 Perak Road with Rocha MRT right at your doorstep. You have two laundromats just beside the hotel and plenty of eateries around. Just to name a few, for local delicacies, you have Sui Chun Dim Sum, Kok Ki Wantan Noodles, Beach Road Caesars Cut Curry Rice. For hipster hangouts, you can check out Chai Seng Huat Hardware, For The People and Char. If you're driving here, there's plenty of street parking available all around. Or you can sign up for season parking at Teka Place. Since we are located in a heritage area, you may wish to check out some of the temples here. My apologies if I mispronounce these names. You can check out Sri Viramakaliaman Temple, Sri Krishnan Temple and Abdul Ghaffar Mosque. You are closely located to Bugis MRT where you have your shopping malls such as Bugis Junction and Jalan Besar MRT as well. So this is the main reception area. It really yeah. feels nice and cosy. Very rustic, right? Yeah. The terracotta tiles and yes. oh, I love what they've done here. It's oh, yeah, like a glass so menagerie. Yeah. Last time shangri -La had something like this. So a lot of natural light comes into the space as well. Oh, this is your favourite section here. Yeah, I'll probably be borrowing this. And I like this water feature over on this side. It provides for this very zen feeling when you enter the hotel, the sound. Wow, look at the whole breakfast corner. Oh. Lots of light, big counter, very bright, lots of windows. You actually you sit and you can see the street view. Yeah, it's very it's interesting. Really nice, really nice. Okay, I think we should check out the rooms. Oh slowly. yeah, that's that's true. Let's go check out the rooms now. So you take the stairs. Okay. <laughs> and I'm going to see what retirement feels like. Cool. So one of the nice touches in this heritage hotel is that you actually have a lift. So if you have heavy luggage or mobility issues, you can use the lift. Now come, let me get some practice. Press and hold. Open the lift. Open the door. Step right in. And it says press and hold. Hmm. So this is what retirement feels like. 
So this really feels like one of those European type lifts somewhere in a heritage home, maybe in Italy or in France. It's a very slow lift, hydraulic lift. So those people who have mobility issues and who have sort of sickness when they move, they will feel okay taking this lift. It's very slow as you can see. Wow, okay, so here we are on the second story. What I really like about this hotel is that before you enter your rooms, you actually have feature decks around here where they actually house ornaments as well as decorative paintings all around. You can see some more over here as well and on the opposite side. All right, all right, so now we are here on the third story of the hotel. This has got to be my favorite spot in the hotel. Just take a look outside at the view, you are facing Abdul Ghaffar Mosque and you have a slight view of Simling Tower as well as Raffles Hospital as well as the hotel behind Duo Residences. So, let me show you a little trick here. This is definitely an Instagrammable area. Boom! So that's how it's done. Okay, now that we've checked out the lobby as well as the common areas of the hotel, let's check out the rooms. Whoa. Okay, so over on my right, you have your covered spaces with your safety deposit box over here. And over on my left, this is where you have your bathroom. And it comes with fresh towels as you can see. So further into the unit, you have this really, really nice desk space as well as a space for your television. A very nice bed. And what I really like is the colonial style windows you have over here. Come on, let's check out the view outside the unit. One eternity later. And we have reached. So as you step out from the lift, you can't help but notice this colonial style atmosphere with nice wooden floors, louvered windows, lots of daylight. Now let's take a look at the room. Well, wow, so I really like that the wooden floors continue into the room. Now that's both for the hygiene and the tactile sensation. I also like the way they've done these wardrobes. They kept the rustic look with the standard kind of rotan. Yeah, very spacious. You even have got your own safe. Now you will get fresh towels twice a week and you have a bathroom with a separate shower cabin, toilet, and a sink, you've got a place to put your luggage, a writing desk, a TV, hairdryer, you've got a mini fridge, hot water jug, and I understand that if you really want to make instant noodles, for example, you can get a cooker on request. Now, what is nice here about this particular room is that you've got a reading light as well as a full length window. Let's see what's the view like. Wow. So again, this is very rare. You actually look into another house, somebody's kitchen, but it's a very unique sensation for staying in this type of heritage hotel. So actually it's a very comfortable space, whether you want to chill out, relax, you want to do your reading, you want to do your work, and it's very quiet here. So if you are in between houses or you want to take an extended staycation or you are rebuilding your house or you are renovating your property, whatever it is, the room rates here range between $1,000 to $1,200 per month only. If you'd like to find out more or if you'd like to have a reservation done here, please call the number down below and quote Janie's for that special heritage experience. What are some of the things you like about this hotel? Leave it in the comment section below. If you like this video, smash that like button, subscribe for more real estate weekly content and click on the bell icon for notifications. 
I'm Sharon. I'm Richard. We are the Janies and we'll, we'll see, see you on, on the, the next, next one. one. Oh, look at the views outside. Very nice. I see yeah. the street view outside. That's what I like about yeah. these type of places, you know? Yeah.